This video is brought to you by Islamgram Official. Before we delve into the personal narratives of those who have faced the harsh realities of conflict, allow us to take you on a journey through the rich historical tapestry of Palestine. Nestled in the heart of the Middle East, Palestine's history dates back thousands of years, its story woven by a diverse multitude of cultures, religions, and civilizations. From the ancient Canaanites to the modern Palestinians, this region has played a pivotal role in shaping the world's history and its cultural heritage is a living testament to its past. The beauty of Palestine is as diverse as its population. Imagine taking a stroll through age-old olive groves, their gnarled trunks holding stories of generations past. These groves, a symbol of resilience and hope, have provided sustenance to its people for centuries. Beyond the fertile land, the breathtaking Mediterranean coastline unfurls, a tranquil contrast to its turbulent history. Now, let's consider the story of Ahmed, a father of three, who once owned an olive grove in the West Bank. His family had tended to these trees for generations, their lives entwined with the very roots of Palestine. But one morning, Ahmed woke up to the sight of bulldozers, and within hours, his livelihood was reduced to rubble. The olive trees that once stood tall and proud, a testament to, to the cycles of life and the vibrancy of the Palestinian spirit, were now nothing more than a memory. This is but one tale among thousands, a testament to the relentless displacement faced by Palestinians. Then, there's the story of Fatima, a young woman with dreams as vast as the Mediterranean Sea. She was a student, eager to learn and contribute to her community. But her dreams were abruptly halted when her school in Gaza was bombed, turning her haven of knowledge into a heap of ruins. Fatima's story resonates with many Palestinian children who are robbed of their childhood, their education, their basic human rights. And who can forget the heart-wrenching incident at Al-Aqsa Mosque? Devout Palestinians gathered for prayer, seeking peace and solace within the sacred walls. But instead, they found themselves in the midst of violence, their sanctuary violated, their prayers disrupted, this incident wasn't an isolated one. It is a chilling reminder of the threats to religious freedom in Palestine. These stories paint a picture of life under occupation, a life that is marked by loss, fear, and uncertainty. But amidst these hardships, the spirit of Palestinians remains unbroken. Their resilience is a beacon of hope, their courage and inspiration to us all. Now imagine if these stories were shared with the world if every tale of loss and resilience could touch a heart, change a mind, or even shape policy. The narratives of Palestine are not mere stories. They are lived experiences that demand global attention and action. So, here's where you come in. Use your voice to amplify these stories. Share them with your friends, your family, your social network. Discuss them at your dinner table, in your classrooms, at your workplaces. Let the world know about the struggles and resilience of Palestinians. You see, change often begins with a conversation, and your voice could be the catalyst for that change. Not tomorrow, not someday, but today. Because for the likes of Ahmed, Fatima, and countless others in Palestine, justice delayed is justice denied. Raise awareness, initiate conversations, and advocate for justice, because every voice matters. And together, we can ensure that the stories of Palestine are not forgotten, but heard, understood, and acted upon. Let us stand in solidarity with Palestine for humanity, for justice, for peace.